it's out of control, uh, the whole thing. Uh, when it first started, I just thought that it was one isolated incident and it would blow over in a few days. But uh, more and more seems to be coming out and there's a media storm out there. But yet there would be because supermarkets are an easy target. They're there on the high street, they're visible, you can see us. But that blame is wrongly placed. Supermarkets, British supermarkets, are the best in the world at quality control. You wouldn't believe the army of technologists that visit suppliers checking for everything. Production runs, hygiene, taking samples for bacteria. And of course, nobody's been testing for horse meat. Well, why would there? There's lots of other things that we haven't been testing for. Um, so it seems to me that this has come from one or two rogue backstreet abattoirs who have sold meat illegally to the lower end of uh, what I would consider to be the catering industry and there is contamination occurred. And I'll say this, horse flesh, when we talk about horse meat, I don't think any horse meat has ever been found in a supermarket product. There's been microscopic quantities of DNA cross-contamination uh, and how that's got there, it's, I don't know. It's because uh, of this illegal meat supply that's out there.